They calls New Year's Day one of the deadliest days on the road because of drunk drivers. State police have been ramping up patrols all through the holidays. Joining us now with some friendly reminders before you celebrate the new year. We have Trooper First Class Pedro Muniz with Connecticut State Police. Thanks for joining us. Thank you for having me. So state police troopers have been out this whole holiday season, not just this weekend. It's been pretty much the whole month so far. How has this year been in regards to getting impaired drivers off the roads compared to years past? Um, we've been it, we've seen the same uh, issues. We're still seeing uh, people driving under the influence of alcohol and or drugs, um, even through the Christmas season, Thanksgiving. Um, so. We're just asking everyone this New Year's, as you just stated, it's one of the deadliest uh, due to alcohol. So we just ask everybody to drive, drink responsibly. We always talk about the importance of getting a designated driver, right? For everyone's sake, can you talk about buzz driving and the misconception around how drivers might still feel safe to drive, but they probably aren't? Yeah, just one, um, one alcohol, one drink can, um, affect your driving can affect can impair you can affect your judgment uh slow you down on your reflexes so even if you're planning on drinking no matter how much it is uh use a ride share program use a designated driver uh, do something to keep you and the others on the road safe and what should we do if we see someone swerving on the roads absolutely so uh we can we need the help of the public uh everyone out there driving. If you see uh, someone driving erratically, crossing over the line, swerving a little too much, uh, call 911, let us know so that we can hurry up and get out there. The quicker we can get out there, uh, the sooner we can address that problem and keep everyone safe. So should we monitor like where we are, um, you know, mile markers? What, are, what kind of information are you looking for? Uh, the best thing you do is know what direction of travel you are if you're on the highway. So if you're on 91 north or south, 84 if you're traveling east or west, and your nearest exit. So if you just passed an exit, if you're coming up on an exit, that's going to be the best way. Uh, don't worry about the mile markers. Just know in the vicinity of where, where you are. Okay, great. I've always wondered that myself when I'm out on the roads. Okay, and then what should we do if we see someone grab the keys, one of our family members, one of our friends, and we think, oh, they really shouldn't get behind the wheel right now? Yeah, uh, let's keep each other safe this holiday, right? This Bringing this new year, let's keep each other safe. If you truly see a friend, a loved one uh, that's drunk, that has a little bit too much alcohol in their system and they shouldn't be driving, Drive them home, keep their keys, let them stay over, um, get them a ride share. It's going to be a lot cheaper to get a ride share than and get a DUI or uh, a loved one be injured or even worse. Yeah, even worse affects somebody else. All right, thank you so much, Trooper Muniz, for these important reminders. And also, thank you for uh, your service working out there, especially through the holidays, and we appreciate it. Thank you for having me.